Hi everyone, it's Tish with Naptime Creations. Welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. And if you're new, don't forget to subscribe. It's free and it'll help me out a lot. So hit that subscribe button. Today we're going to be doing some acrylic pouring over a resin coaster that I had made that didn't quite turn out. I'm going to be using my Gen Crafts pre-mix ready to pour paints. These are so easy to use. All you have to do is shake the bottle and they're ready to pour. So here's my resin coaster. I gave it a light sand um, just by hand with some 320 grit sandpaper to give it a little bit of a tooth so the paint will adhere nicely to it. Cleaned it off with a rag and some 91% isopropyl alcohol and now I'm going in with my paints. And when I did this, I was thinking of kind of like a yin, yin yang um, design when I went in with my colors. I'm just going to give it a tilt so everything has nice coverage on the top and the edges. And that's pretty much it. Now we're going to go in and do our swipes. I'm going to be using my swipe tools from Acrylic Pouring with Friends, Tracy Reed. I'll link them down below in the description box. They make swiping so easy. And my cell activator is Amsterdam Oxide Black and Australian Floetrol. And I mix that one teaspoon paint to one tablespoon Australian Floetrol. And I'll link all of this down below in the description box. I'm just going in and doing some swipes until I'm happy with how the design looks. And this technique is so easy and fun. I hope you guys give it a try. It's a great way to kind of jazz up resin coasters that you're just not happy with. And then you can go in and do a clear top coat of resin and turn them into coasters again. It's a really fun way to kind of just switch it up so here's how it's looking. I kind of really liked it just like this. Um, I had some really fun cells, but I am going to go in and do some swirl designs. This is just a little toothpick. And when I do this, I like to do one down the center and then one on each side. And I'm just doing little swirl motions. Here's how it's looking with the wet finish. I really love adding the swirls, but I don't know if I should have added them. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments, if you like it better with the swirls or without. And here's how it is all dry. It dried perfectly. These paints dry with a nice glossy sheen. You can kind of see at the bottom there, they're really nice and glossy. I'll link them down below along with my coupon code. So if you guys want to try some out, you can get a little bit of extra savings. Let me know what you guys think of this one down in the comments. I hope you give it a try. Um, like I said, it's a great way to kind of switch it up if you have some resin coasters that you made that you're just not happy with. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys are all doing fantastic and I will see you soon for another video. Bye guys.